You know, as we were just saying, it's the fourth night of Hanukkah. Holidays are here, so we want to make sure you're prepared to host a gathering that includes a bubbly, festive staple, which is champagne. Joining me now is entertaining guru Tracy Redman from the Red Daisy in, in, in uh, Neptune Beach. Thank you so much Thank for coming you. back to yes. talk about one of my favorite things, yeah, yeah. which is uh, champagne. And you know, and it's not just, it's something that you find people have at a lot of parties, right. people give us gifts, people bring us hostess gifts. Oh, yes. So it is just a staple during this month. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you can go from a super fancy mm -hmm. champagne bar like this all the way down to drinks in the driveway. Drinks in the driveway, so, you okay. Know, you can <laughs> so let's start with drinks in the driveway. Okay. What did you call this earlier? This is the... the it's kind of the... Country version <laughs> of <laughs> champagne. We might use a different term, but, but, it's, but I mean, it's a fun. champagne in a, in a mason jar. You know, you can put it's it in a galvanized. Back. It is. It's very laid back. The and laid back version. And a great gift that goes along with Ooh. it is we have this really fun book at Red Daisy. What is that? It's called Booze and Vinyl, and it combines your favorite album oh. with the drink that you should drink with it. Oh, are you serious? Isn't that cool? <laughs> so it's the songs and you can drink along with your favorite songs. Right. That's really Isn't neat. that fun? So that's something you could have some drinks in the yeah. driveway while listening to some music. I like it. Yes. So, you know, I, another thing too, I think a lot of times people do bring a bottle of champagne as hostess gifts. You have Absolutely. other options that they, well, first of all, let's talk about if they want to bring the champagne, maybe set yours apart by doing something like this. Well, you know, it's my favorite. Take a tea towel and wrap mm -hmm. a pretty tea towel around it. That way they have the gift after you drink mm -hmm. The champagne so it's something that that you'll always have as a fun little tea towel or these are super popular okay this, this keeps it fuzzy it does so you can once you open the champagne fuzzy mm -hmm. fizzy, fizzy. Yeah. you get fuzzy yeah. after yeah. you <laughs> drink the fizzy how about that <laughs> i haven't had any yet i promise <laughs> if this snaps around the neck and then you screw the top on and it keeps the bubbles Ooh. in for a couple of days and then you have a ton of different really little cocktail napkins, napkins for champagne yes. which makes a great gift to also <laughs> champagne the most elegant way to get hammered <laughs> so you can take your bottle put it in a bag with <laughs> cocktail napkins and it. a couple of cute little glasses we yes. have these these, These are, are great. really cool. Okay. Champagne, glass, champagne flutes, mm -hmm. stemless flutes, and we have had the beaches zip codes put on all of them. Oh, I so love that. So that's those. two of those in a bottle is a Terrific. Two of those, yeah, perfect. So I want to come back to these. I want to talk about this. Oh, look at are these ornaments. Yes. <gasps> oh How my cute goodness. Is that these too? are look, so you can cute. Watch this. Yes. This makes Shummy. a really, really cute gift. Oh, you hang it over the champagne Just hang bottle. Hang it right on there. So then they have that after. Oh, you I drink love the that. Champagne. Okay. So then we go over here. We have our fancy champagne. Now we're getting a little more elegant. Okay. Doesn't necessarily always have to be in a flute. You can put it. These are vintage parfait glasses. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that's this nice. Is a champagne cocktail, which a lot of people are familiar with the poinsettia, which mm -hmm. is ch uh, cranberry juice. Yep. This is pomegranate juice, and you set out a little champagne bar with some cute things, and add the pomegranate, pomegranate seeds in there. in there, and you're ready to go. This looks beautiful as well, and you have all this available at the store Absolutely. too. And then finally, I want to talk about these, because I think these are really unique gifts too. This is something you also give that hangs off yes. the champagne bottle, like you see right here. This is the high-end, really go-for-it gift. Mm -hmm. This is called the bobble stocking. Okay. Not bubbles, bobbles. Bobbles. Bobble. Okay. And the girl that made these, these are all handmade needlepoint sto little baby mm -hmm. stockings. And they're okay. You hang them, the, the tradition to start is you hang it on the tree. And in this inside is the gift for mom. On or Christmas your, morning. On Christmas morning yeah. or your special someone. Okay. And it's the last gift to be open to thank that person for all they do throughout the year. So Diamonds. you hang this. Diamonds. Diamonds. <laughs> hang this on a really fancy <laughs> bottle of champagne and then you have this tradition for, the, oh. for every year and years to come. I think it would be an excellent gift for a bride-to-be. Oh, that's a good idea. Wouldn't that be great? Yes, I yes. love this. So that's a, a really good, fun, gorgeous gift to give. All right, once again, you can find all these great ideas at the Red Daisy. Stop there before you host or go to your holiday party, yes, Tracy. Please. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you.